T. No, but I mean on defense, did you did you ever? I'm trying to think. Did I actually come off the field? Uh, I might have come off a few. I think Dante got a series maybe of like four plays. Um, but no, I played a significant amount. Uh, I know the exact number, but it's it's definitely a lot more than I've it's played. It's in the 90s? <laughs> yeah, it's in the 90s. And did you feel any different playing 90-some snaps versus 60-some snaps? Uh, no, I felt pretty good because I knew... I want to be there rather than Troy Pride being, um, because, uh, yeah, better things happen, I feel like, when I'm in, in Troy. <laughs> but, I mean, from from a uh, conditioning standpoint, from a soreness standpoint, there was really no difference for you? No, in seriousness, no. Uh, I felt pretty good. I didn't know my plays were, I didn't know we played that many plays, actually. I was kind of playing the game. I feel like when you're out there, when I'm out there, it feels normal, no matter how many plays I play. Um, they realized that I played a lot, obviously, so they made sure I rehabbed the right way and have been hydrating the right way um, and handling that. Um, but I didn't really notice. And then same how th- frustrating was last week? Um, <laughs> it, <laughs> it, I was frustrated for sure. Um, you know, because we, I mean, we want to be the best. Um, and our mindset as a whole program, I'm not going to say the players, I'm not going to say the coaches, but the whole program wasn't in the right frame. Um, we, you know, we, so, I mean, let's be honest, we overlooked uh, Ball State and what they could do. Um, but they were, they were a solid team, they put up a great fight. Uh, and so I was frustrated with our approach, I'd say more than anything. I thought, you know, we handled adversity when we realized uh, we're in a battle. I thought our defense uh, stepped up and we played pretty well. Um, we reached some of our numbers that we tried to reach, um, and uh, it was more so of the approach of our our team. Uh, that's what got me frustrated a little bit. Compared and then now, to how motivating is things for you guys so coming off of that to want to kind of show everybody what the Notre Dame standard really is? Well, I mean, college football, when you do, we don't prepare, I guess, to your full capabilities and still come out with a win, uh, that's always a good day. So um, I had to calm myself down and realize that. And, you know, my family, my girlfriend helped me realize that, like, we won the game. And, and so that helps us going forward. And so now I mean, realize what we have to do. And so we've been really intentional this week. We've been really grinding, working hard, getting back to our roots, and not taking a day uh, for granted. Compare the two quarterbacks, last week's and this week's. What do, you, do you see any similarities? Uh, or uh, In terms of uh, Vanderbilt's? Yeah. And, um, and yeah, I think they're very similar. They're big frame, um, big arm, and they're smart quarterbacks. Um, and so I think you got to be prepared for it all because they're competitors. And the guy we have uh, against Vanderbilt, um, he's a competitor. And so you know, we got to prepare uh, in the best way possible to compete with that. And they've got their.